Hey guys, so it is January, no it's not. It is the day before January 1st, so <laughs> not me having to look at my calendar, wow. I literally couldn't figure out if there was 30 days in December or 31. Mm. It's not okay to be this dumb. Anyways, today is December 31st, the day before January 1st, 2024. What? Just wild, it's wild. And you guys are gonna be surprised. I'm not wearing hoops today. I'm wearing these pink earrings, but I low key wanna put on hoops. <gasps> Hold on, I'll be right back. Okay, I feel more like myself. I feel so much better now. We got the hoops in. I was trying to do something different. And I was like, let's wear these cute like heart moment. Oh my God. And I know my nails look bad, but not for long. Anyways, happy, I was gonna say happy Christmas Eve. <laughs> I should just start this whole vlog over, but I'm not going to. Happy New Year's Eve. I hope that you guys have a great one. I'm trying to decide like, do I wanna drink tonight? I haven't drank since the last time you guys saw me drink. And I plan on going into 2024, like alcohol free a little bit. So it's like, do I want to tonight as my last little moment? I don't know. I, I guess you guys will find out with me. So this is my closet and normally I keep this door open and this door open because I just like them to be open. But Rarity keeps playing with my balloons and I'm about to leave the um, apartment. So it's like, I don't want her to like hurt herself with like the ribbon or whatever. So I have to keep both of my doors shut, which hate that. Okay, so before and after, hey. I got matte black and my mom got rainbow and I chose all the colors for her. <laughs> <laughs> that was fun. <laughs> okay guys, so I'm currently doing my grocery shopping and we have my typical raw veggies and cottage cheese and sausage about to start. And my new favorite cleaner ever, Clorox all-purpose cleaner which i'm sure everyone and their mom knows all about it i'm just very much used to using the brand method so i've been using that for years until i was like let me try clorox it actually works better i've been on the prowl for the peanut butter because i was looking for pb2 so i had to literally ask someone where it is literally the chip aisle the very aisle i did not want to go to well there's quite a few i didn't want to go to but all right well found it and now i have everything all right, so I came home to drop everything off. Everything is thrown in there pretty messily. I don't really have that much time because I'm actually about to go out to dinner with my mom and her boyfriend. Look at this person's car. Like that's neat. And I kind of like the car too. It looks like candy canes. Yeah, the Christmas colors time. are uh, red and white. Cute. So I have been home for a bit now. I did order some alcohol, but it was over two hours ago and it still has not arrived yet. So I ended up talking to customer service because I was confused. I was like, what is happening? And something about like their system shut down. So they're trying to get it to work again. So then they accidentally canceled my order. So then I just like replaced the order. I don't know, it's 9 14 PM right now. So it is getting a little late, but I am hoping that my drinks do get here within like, I guess the hour or so, because I do want to drink tonight. I also ordered Jack in the Box, like so gross, so bad for you, but like I really am starting, you know, <laughs> fresh tomorrow, January 1st, totally Amberlynn coated. I love starting fresh on January 1st. Something about it is just nice. It's just, I don't know what it is, okay? But for some reason, I was just craving a curly fry and Jack in the Box has the best curly fries. And I also know that they have like these jalapeno pepper type things. I think I've probably had like one jalapeno pepper my whole life, like the stuffed ones. So I was like, you know what? They have those, I kind of want to try them. So, okay, so what even time is it? The times on the microwave and the stove are incorrect. So I have no idea, but I got my buzz balls. I got my Jack in a box. We have a little buzz ball haul. I got two of the pineapple coladas. I still have one in my fridge. It's like the Choco something or other. I got a lime Rita and a sour apple. So I think I'm gonna keep the lime Rita out. So I'm gonna drink that now. Put the rest in my fridge. 
Now let's do the Jack in a Box taste test. All right, so I've never had these before. When I lived in California and Arizona, I had Jack in a Box kind of a lot, but I always had their like taco moment. Definitely never had these. So they're, what are they called? Stuffed jalapenos. So that's literally all it is. Mmm, look at that. Wow, this is so unhealthy. This is hitting the spot. Now a little buzz ball. Uh oh, my fingernails gets in the way. But thank God for the good old butter knives. Cheers and happy new years. Spending it alone with y'all. So I was just eating my, um, jalapeno stuffed jalapeno situation type deals when I realized I didn't get my curly fries so that's a sad moment um I didn't really need them but that's the whole reason why I got the good old jack-in-a-box but also did you guys know that it's like bad luck to clean on the 31st of December I've heard this for years now but for some reason like I kept getting so many TikToks about it I don't know what it was about and like, I clean every day, like whether it's like a big deep clean or it's just a little piddly things here and there, like it's just something I do daily, but I haven't cleaned a single thing today. The only thing I've cleaned was I picked up the bags from my grocery haul. So hopefully that doesn't count because supposedly like if you clean on the 31st of December, the whole next year is going to be like not good for you. I don't really believe in like superstitions and stuff like that, but you know what? We're going to test it out. Your girl was a lazy bones today when it came to cleaning. So let's hope that 2024 is a good one because I didn't clean today. Not me being Delulu, like literally Delulu. You guys, it is officially like 12.03. I am red from drinking, don't mind that. But I just got off the phone with my mom. I made sure to message my very best friend in the whole world. My most important people in my life know that I love them. Now I just want you guys to know that I love you guys so much and I appreciate you guys for 2023 it's been one heck of a ride and i always you know go back to like situations and stories and experiences and i'm like oh yeah that was in 2019 or that was in 2011 and now it's like i want to go back and be like wow that was in 2024 that all those amazing things happened so i just hope we all have an amazing year hello everyone it is january 1st 2024 as you guys know, one of my goals for this year is to weigh myself daily because I feel like it helps me stay on track, truly. Like, have you guys ever heard out of sight, out of mind? It's like, if I'm not weighing myself, then that means I'm just not caring. But I want to make it a main focus to care this year. So, daily weigh-ins. Here's the first one. I already know it's going to be bad. I already know. Like, I literally feel it. Hello. It's ready. All right, here we go. First weigh in of 2024. 515.8 pounds. 515.8. Oh my lord. There it is. All right. Let's do this thing, you guys. Let's all reach our goals this year. Okay, so as you guys know, I bought this monthly calendar. It's just like a one of those flipping calendars. You know what I'm talking about. This is just strictly to write my weights down. Um, this is just like the cover page because obviously there's this on it. At first I thought it was a sticker and I had to like tear it off and I was like, okay, that's a lot. But it's actually not. Um, January is right there. Don't you guys find it so satisfying that January 1st falls on a Monday? Like that is so satisfying for me because it's like the beginning of a week, beginning of a new year. I'm just obsessed with that. All right, so I was five... 15.8. All right. I can see myself getting into the 400s in just January. Keep my fingers crossed. I have to do the work though. It's not something I could just wish for. It's something I have to actively try for and work towards. Hey guys, I have a really quick Target haul. I'm looking, <laughs> I'm looking like I had a night last night. So just ignore me. I needed some more dry shampoo and I really love, <laughs> I'm not going to be able to pronounce this right. It's the Batiste. I don't know. Instant hair refresh. It's my favorite. I needed some makeup remover. 
Neutrogena makeup remover ultra soft cleansing towelettes. Also my favorite. But what I really wanted and needed is I got the Ninja Blast portable blender. I wanted the white one, but they sadly did not have it because your girl's about to start making some smoothies. I'm thinking I'm probably gonna have one today. Um, I used to have a Ninja moment, but in my move, I got rid of a lot of stuff. 70% of like what I owned, I got rid of. So that was one of the things. Y'all, I'm back on my shit with the cottage cheese and mustard. So for dinner tonight, I'm having turkey, kielbasa, broccoli, peppers, celery, carrots, asparagus, pickles, radish, um, green olives with garlic, and of course, the mustard and cottage cheese. I have not had this in forever. I remember when I would eat this way, it just made me feel so much better. I was losing weight and I, just, I don't know, I just felt better. So I will talk more about like what I am doing to lose weight fully um, in a future video. And I'm definitely going to be showing more of like the things I'm eating and such. But okay, I'm going to go eat this now. All right, you guys, I officially finished my Pac-Man Lego. Are you ready for the big reveal? It took a lot of time. It was a lot of effort. It took weeks. Are you ready? Bam. There it is. Wow, this took me forever. There was like almost 3,000 pieces. Isn't it the cutest? I'm joking, you guys. That's not the real thing. Here it is. Dun, da, da. Isn't that amazing? Oh my gosh, I love it so much. This is what the sides look like, the back. And then this on the side, you go like this and it moves all the little guys look at that isn't it the cutest thing and then this moves also there's a button back here that i can press and then that happens aren't those guys so cute I'm actually about to go pick out the next one i'm gonna do um i'm not gonna do the brand lego it's gonna be a different brand actually but just as fun so these are the ones I have. Uh, this is the only Lego one that I have that I have not done. But then I have these other brands. Um, this is like a bear robot. We have an Astro Boy, a car. I'm actually debating between these two. Oh, I don't know which one. Eeny, meeny, miny, mo. Ugh. All right, I'm about to show you guys which one I chose. Da -da -da! I chose the Astro Boy. So. I'm probably going to open this up, start this tonight. I'm going to edit this vlog, get it scheduled for you guys. I hope that you guys had a great new year, January 1st. I hope everyone's year is just spread with love and happiness and health. I love you guys so much and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.